Are you looking to install a towel hook or a robe hook in your house? If so, keep watching because in this video, I'll show you how I install this towel hook in our bathroom. Let's do this. First, let's get familiar with how these towel hooks operate. On the inside of the back of the hook, you're gonna notice that there is a plate in there that has four holes in it. Yours may look a little bit different than this, but this is usually what they look like. At the very bottom of the towel hook, there is a pressure screw. It's a pointed screw that helps keep that plate in place. To remove that plate, take the Allen wrench that comes with your hook. Stick it in the bottom, right where this hole is, and unscrew it. You'll notice that as you screw it, the screw comes down out of the back of the towel hook, and the pressure plate is released. Looking at the plate, you'll notice that it has two ends that are lifted up, kind of like little wings hanging out there. They fit inside the back of your hook so that it will hold tightly after you install it on the wall and put the hook on it. When you put that pressure screw in, it'll keep it in place. Step one is to figure out where you're going to put the hook. Ideally, you wanna put stuff like this in a wall stud if possible. In this case where I'm hanging my towel hook, I actually have a wall stud behind the wall. If you do not have a stud behind the wall where you're going to be hanging your towel hook, use self-drilling drywall anchors. They will give you the best hold in your drywall so that your hook does not move. You can see here where my old towel hook was hanging. Ignore these old drywall anchors. I'll be pulling these out and repairing the drywall in another video, but for now, let's just get this new one installed. Step two, mark your holes. Use a small level to ensure that that pressure plate is level up and down side to side before you mark your holes. If you're using the self-drilling drywall anchors, this is where you wanna make a couple of marks in your wall. If you wanna understand a little bit more about these self-drilling drywall anchors, check out the link in the description below and I'll link you to a video where I'll give you more instruction on that. However, if you're going straight into the wall stud, I highly recommend pre-drilling before you do so. Once you have your pre-drilled holes completed, put the pressure plate up against the wall, take your screws and put them all the way in. Double check to make sure that your side to side and your up and down are in the proper location to keep that pressure plate level while you're putting it in the wall. Now that that plate is mounted to the wall, take the towel hook and start from the top and put it on. You just wanna put the top piece on top of the plate and hinge it right down. Get it centered into the spot where you need it and now you can take your Allen wrench and put the pressure screw up underneath. Simply put the wrench inside the hole, turn it to the right until it is nice and firmly tight. Now your towel hook is on the wall, but if you want a little bit more information on how to use those self-drilling drywall anchors for this installation, check out this video. Until the next time, keep doing it yourself.